So I'm going to try and make a better video on how to set up a FastDL on your Garry's Mod server. My other video was okay, but it, I didn't really know much about it, and I also told you to add a lot of files in there that you didn't actually need. Now, this isn't going to be a very popular video as Garry's Mod 13 has been released, but this will also work for that as well, I think. Um, as I don't think you would have any need to change the... Um, the coding for that, so hopefully you sh this will also work for guys mod 13. So um, I'm gonna try and take my time now as well as I can upload longer videos um, because I have started compressing my videos much better. So yeah, let's get started. So first thing you're gonna need is a web server. I would recommend Evo hosting as that's what I'm using, but my uh, INX Gaming, who are the people I bought my server off, have provided uh, all of my servers, or all of the servers on Legendary Community, with a fast DL. So we get it for free. But for EVO hosting, you can buy one for the same that I'm using. So, um, I'm going to go to the FTP of my, uh, oh, critical error. It seems that I'm having problems. So... I will log in. So, there we go. Right, now this is my control panel for my um, my web server. And the domain is commando semi serious at inxgaming.com because I haven't paid for it. But once you buy a server, you should get a free one. Um, so you can use that domain or you can buy one. You can buy one if you want it to look better, and you could also set up a website on there, whatever. So, I'm going to go to my um, file manager. And it's out. let me just pause the video, I'll see if uh, I can get it. Okay guys, it is actually working, I've just logged into the um, into my FTP for my web server, and now it's working, I was using the wrong password. So, here is your base... Uh, Directory for is a root folder structure for your file for your web server. Sorry. Um, now you're gonna want to create your fastdl in either public HTML or www. I would recommend public HTML. Once you're inside there, create your folder by right-clicking and clicking create directory, and call it fastdl. No capital letters, just all lowercase like that. Go ahead and once you've created your folder, in here you're going to want to create these folders. Add-ons, cache, actually no, add-ons we don't actually need that. I can remove that. Okay. Blah 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 blah. Okay, right, so you're gonna want to create these files. Cache, maps, materials, materials maps, models and sounds. These are the files that you want in here. And once you have created those files, every time you um, every time you add a add-on to the server, if it doesn't have custom content that materials or models, you won't need to add anything like that. But when you update the map, you will need to put the map in here, the whole map, obviously. Um, if the map has custom materials, um, you will put it in materials maps. Uh, models. Uh, if you add an add-on to the server that has custom models and materials, you want to put them in the materials folder, obviously the materials, and put the models in the models folder. Custom sounds, obviously, in the sounds folder. And every time you restart the server, once you've added an add-on or changed something, a cache will be updated. And what you want to do is, also, I have two in here. I don't know why. Okay, I need to delete those. So every time you add an add-on to the server, a new cache will be updated, and you'll find that in your service garage mod folder, and then cache. Um, delete the old one, keep the new one, and then put the new one, copy it to uh, copy it to the fastdl so people can download it. And that's all you need to know about that. Now, once so as you see, my domain. If I open up my browser, and if I type in this. I think this might be it, I have no idea. Okay, no, that isn't it. Okay, it's uh, commandos, semi-serious, there we go. 
command that's my domain that they've given me. I haven't bought one, so they've added INX Gaming onto it. And because I created it in public HTML, and public HTML allows the users or guests to actually see uh, inside it. So if you type fastl, it will bring up the directory for that folder. As you can see, I have cache, maps, materials, and all that. So there it is. That is it. That domain, highlight it, and copy it. Then, if you go to your fastl, and go to your server, um, my server is here. So this is my server. Um, just go to the Gary's Mod folder, and then once you're in Gary's Mod, go to CFG, and then click on server.cfg. Now, here you can set the name. You can set, you can set quite a lot. Um, so uh if I you can set your default game mode here. Uh and you're gonna wanna create these folders. These folders? What am I about? These uh, this text. SV download URL and then you want quotation marks and then your I will also put this text in into the uh description so you can copy and paste it. And when you do paste it, just go to the very bottom of this file, create a new line and paste it. Um, and then you'll put your link in there for your first deal, and then so as you can see there's my link. SV allow download um, and then you want to put that to one. Zero would not let them download it. One will let them download it. Because uh, one is yes, zero is no. Think of it like that. And SV allow upload, you want that to one as well. And once you've done that, that is it. Um, your server is now. Obviously, you want to save it, and then your server is now uh, set up with FastDL. So, thanks for watching, and yeah.